Well, we knew it was going to be a physical battle. Uh, you know, we came out and uh, the first half I felt were physical. Uh, we defended well and, and at spells we moved the ball well. Um, but as the game went on, uh, I think tiredness kicked in. We lost a little bit of composure. We got a little bit frustrated. And it shows in the fact that we only had seven assists on the offensive end. We didn't move it as well. And that led in them scoring some easy baskets. I think they had something like 25 points in, in fast break. And they had 50 overall in the lane. And we only had 10. We were not able to get in the lane as much. And I think a lot had to do with getting a second or a third side to it. But bottom line is, you know, it has been a very difficult five, six days for us. Uh, we had a big win against London on Friday. And then we had to go and play in Glasgow and we had to play a four overtime game and today we were three men down uh, and and you know guys came to battle but as the game went on I think it was just a little bit too much for us and now it's all about Saturday we've got to come straight ahead uh, it's all about Manchester it's a do or die type of game for us we've got to go out and we've got to compete and we've got to play 40 minutes of our type of basketball the right way like we've been doing the last three games Talk about that busy schedule. Just what's it been like trying to manage that workload in this busy period now? Man, it has been difficult. I mean, it has been tough. The guys have been great. Uh, you know, our performances have been very strong. Um, and, but at the same time, you know, you got to utilize the time off to rest. Uh, I think our our two Craigs have been amazing. Our strength and conditioning coach and our physio. They've been working with the players. We'll be doing recovery sessions in the swimming pool, stretching. All those kind of things have really helped guys. Um, but you know, it's got to take its toll. And and you know, Jalen has not been able to play the last couple of games. Chris Taylor as well has been recovering for from a Leon injury. Uh, and Mike today, kind of thing. You know, with his ankle. Uh, you know, the reality is he just came back three or four games ago uh, and it has been too much um, but you know that's the t everyone is going through the same thing you know it, it, it's a tough league it's tough those back-to-back -back games kind of thing I mean we knew we're entering this period where within like eight days we're playing like four basketball games and physical basketball games we're talking like twice against the league leaders Glasgow one almost the more formidable teams and now Manchester another physical team that has been doing really really well this year so we knew it was not going to be easy but 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 this is about toughness right now at this point of the season this is about getting things done and, and playing the right way and that's what we want to do uh, it's all about Saturday we've got to utilize the next couple of days to get our bodies right uh, work on our game plan and be ready for Saturday for a big game Talk about Saturday, it quickly focuses now to Saturday's game and a big one in terms of the playoff race too. Yep, I think Manchester know it, we know it. Uh, all our players uh, are fully aware of the situation kind of thing. Uh, we need our fans, we need their support. Um, it's a home game for us with a huge importance in terms of the playoff race. The playoffs have started really. I mean, that's it, bottom line. Um, and there's no turning back from it. Uh, we're fully aware of it. Um, you know, I think we've taken some big steps forward the last few weeks. Uh, and now we've got to put everything on the line in the next 40 minutes. Uh, and just, you know, We've talked about it, it's about doing things the right way and when you do things the right way everything else takes care of itself and that's what it is about right now. We've got to make sure we have most of our guys fit and healthy, ready for the game and we'll go from there.